Good afternoon, happy Wednesday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, I'm taking the camera out again today because I want to test out a little low light. Um, it's seven o'clock right now. It's actually warm today. It is like 85 was a high today, so I actually wore a long sleeve shirt and shorts. Um, but the clouds, it's supposed to rain. It's supposed to get really cold again. Today's supposed to be like the one warm day and I'm actually going out with my dad right now. But I wanted to try and test out the camera and see a little low light and how it does because it is dark out and show you guys actually what the clouds look like outside because they kind of do look pretty cool. It is actually there's a bat. That is a bat up there. <laughs> it is flying around. Um, and I know that because that is what they look like when they're flying at the baseball or the football games. But yeah guys, the um, this actually does look really good in low light but it's supposed to rain I think and again get cooler but the clouds right now just look really pretty so I thought I'd take my camera out here maybe get a few pictures as well and test those out but it's windy as you guys can see and they look so pretty holy cow there's that bat again <laughs> um but yeah they just look really pretty out it's still out there oh my gosh okay I'm gonna get in the car Charles why are you acting the crazy oh my goodness look at that face look at that face look at that puppy face Oh my gosh, why are you so crazy? How come when we were watching the game you were acting so psycho? Like crazy, like jumping all over the place and on top of me. Huh? What? Why are you so excited? Why are you so excited? Oh, Mr. Johnny. Oh, I love you too. Oh, I love you too. You're my best friend. You're, well, you're one of my best friends. The other best friend is on the floor biting at his butt. Yeah. Oh, I look at that face. That little face. Oh my goodness. You are so cute. There he is. There's my other buddy. Hi, other buddy. Hi, other buddy. Like, other buddy. <laughs> <coughs> oh. What? 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 You're really excited about something, and I don't know what it is. You want something from me, but Jack just took you out. I already fed you. I don't know what else you need, but you're acting like some. you need something from someone. Just attention? Do you just need attention? <laughs> and you, poor dog, always get denied attention, don't you? Don't you, Mr. B? Don't you, Mr. B? Yep. Yeah, here comes Jolly McJellerson. Oh, I'm so sorry. I love you both. I love you both. I do. I love you both. So guys, I am testing out using the camera with the tripod and holding it at the same time to see if it's a little bit lighter because honestly, guys, I realized that it is not, I told you guys this too yesterday, it's not a light camera. It feels way lighter um, or like easier to hold, I guess, not technically. I'm actually holding more weight right now, but because I can hold it at a lower level, it's actually making it a little bit easier on my arm. The tripod is going to be how we're holding this camera from now on. It's just a little too difficult to hold it well I'm trying to um, record and keeping it level at the right level and everything like that so yeah this is way better guys so guys that bat update on that bat it must have been eating bugs or something like that possibly mosquitoes because there were tons of mosquitoes outside literally I walked to the car I got in the car as soon as I got in the car I got a mosquito bite right on my hand there were so many mosquitoes out it is so humid out today guys it is ridiculously hot I told you guys today was like 85 or something like like that and um, I actually had to turn my air conditioner on because it was just too hot for me um, but yeah so it was humid out and everything like that it's supposed to rain um, or no actually I don't think it's supposed to tomorrow it's actually not supposed to rain but it is supposed to cool down it's supposed to I think rain like tonight or something like that and then on Friday it's also supposed to rain I did see thunderstorms on Friday now it looks like it's only just gonna be rain which is a little bit better at least for the football game <laughs> but Matthew is coming home on Friday and I think that is when we are going to exchange cameras so I'm gonna give him my old camera and he's gonna record on it and he's gonna actually send me the film and we're going to possibly include them in the vlogs as well so it depends on how much he gets every day and like what he even records and stuff like that um as to how much and what we end up you know adding to the vlogs and stuff like that but a little from matthew's perspective will possibly be coming as well he'll wind up getting that over this weekend so i don't know if he'll maybe test out over this weekend too just kind of what he's doing while he's home or if he's only going to do it monday once he goes back to school so like i said we will see but we do have a lot of interesting stuff planned for this weekend 
and far as like activities and stuff like that i think we're going to a pumpkin patch um i honestly thought well it's like a local farm they do like a lot of stuff i think they do like hay rides and stuff like that and like they have a pumpkin patch and everything like that and mainly it's for like the fall and stuff but um me and my mom literally just went there i was thinking i was telling you guys in a different vlog um we picked up our mom's actually from there they sell like local produce they sell you know that kind of stuff and you know just different you know farm like things i think and they um have like i said the mums they have um corn stalks which is another thing guys that i'm going to get and i'll tell you guys that in a second about my cool little um fall kind of design theme outside that i'm gonna do um but yeah so that like that kind of stuff but we're gonna go there and like i don't mind it that much but i kind of wanted to go to like that we're gonna go to like a corn maze and like or a further away pumpkin place or whatever like i was just there a few weeks ago it's not like anything unique and it's not really that big either and they have like petting zoos and stuff like that and like farm animals to ride and everything i feel like it's geared more towards little kids it's not so much for like adults and stuff like that but anyways guys yeah so we do have some fun stuff coming in this weekend's vlog and i can again test out my camera a little bit more and see how it works um, you know, and just again try out some other things. So I've been trying to take some different pictures and, you know, video and stuff like that. Like I said, I told you guys to testing out a little low light and see how it works. Because I did hear that this camera does work really well in low light. My other camera actually did work pretty well in low light, I'd have to say considering it wasn't like a super super fancy expensive camera or anything like that but i thought it did do decently well it worked better than my phone so i guess it's not saying too much but it's still it's like older than my phone anyway like my phone isn't a camera but it still is like my phone is newer so i'd expect there to be like more low light features and stuff like that or like better features there really isn't it still holds up better i think than my my phone does and my phone also too gives off like a weird shading when i record with it and i notice it when i'm editing like if i recorded something on my phone or if i record it on my camera um and again obviously it's phone quality but it is an iphone i don't know seven i think maybe it's seven <laughs> um even though i think like what 10 came out but didn't they skip nine isn't that how that worked or something anyways i am editing actually guys because here's where my me mess up for the whole day ended up happening I threw my um all of all three of my towels that I use in the dry in the washing machine and I was like oh I'll be totally fine I'll be able to get it out of the dryer before I have to take a shower tonight and everything well only maybe like less than a half an hour ago did the dryer finally end or the washing machine I got this stuff out of the washing machine put it in the dryer and, and then like half an hour ago now the dryer is finally done so now I can finally take a shower and use my um what's it called my my towels because all three of them I threw in the, the washing machine all at the same time because I'm so smart and just decided <laughs> that was the best course of action um no it wasn't so I had finished editing two vlogs and the dryer still wasn't done and I was like you know what I'm just gonna go do another two and it, at the time it was only 10 o'clock and I was like oh I could probably get two more done by the time the dryer's done and everything like that well no it's now 12 30 and I just finished the fourth vlog the dryer finally finished like about a half hour ago and now I'm gonna go take a shower um but I was making my grocery list I went and cleaned the refrigerator which that's back to my corn stock thing in just a second guys I'll get there um but I ended up doing my grocery list there's partial partial parts of my grocery list edited four vlogs like I said I cleaned the like outside of the refrigerator the doors and everything like that um, I don't even know what else I ended up doing a handful of other stuff and now I'm finally ready for bed guys but I was up at 8 o'clock or 8 eight thirty this morning or something like that because I just woke up and I couldn't fall back asleep and so um yeah I <laughs> was up super early and now I'm going to bed super late tonight now on to my corn stock um <laughs> my little corn stock story so I have a small little list of like chores that I think I told you guys last week. My mom gave them to me. I got those chores done. One was like organizing the closet and all that stuff that we ended up doing last week. And now this week, um, my mom gave me another one. And I was like, well, if I do all this stuff in my list, because I've been asking for little incentives. Um, I said, if I get everything done on my list, like what's going to be my incentive?
incentive for this week. My mom's like, you'll get your corn stalk, Kayla. Which, guys, I've been wanting a corn stalk because one year, years ago, we had a corn stalk and we have like a little... It's not like a column, kind of like a column thing. I don't think it technically supports the roof, but there is a roof overhang where our stoop is, like out in our front of our house. Um, and so it's like this little like column looking thing. And like I said, I don't think it's really a support column or anything like that because it's like you can wiggle it and it's not it's not sturdy in there at all. If it is a support column, then we're in trouble. It shouldn't really be. I think it's just decorative. But so we have this little column thing and we had one year a corn stalk and we like tied rope around the corn stalk and like had it up against this little, um, you know, column thing that's outside. And it looks, so, I don't know if it really looks so cute, but I just really like that. And I like that fall like theme and stuff like that. And like, I want to get a little hay bale and put a hay bale outside and like decorate like the front deck. For fall because I've been so into like outdoor you know plants and stuff like that lately that I want to do something that's a little fall themed you know I planted the mums and everything like that so that'll give us some nice color there and then I want to do something that's a little bit more like you know fall looking and stuff so that's what I'm thinking about doing for um, you know when we go this weekend if I finish up all my little um, chores and stuff like that I can go and pick that up and then decorate outside kind of for fall but you throw it away Way and you don't use it next year just like Christmas tree and so like I don't know I kind of just I like I want something like that that's just a cutesy I don't know how much they cost I did see some at Caputo's but we couldn't see the price from where we were um because they had it in like their garden shed section but they did have some of them and so if I don't find any at this corn place that we're going to the corn maze place or pumpkin farm whatever um then I'll probably pick one up just at Caputo's. But I want to support like a local business and everything like that and pick one up from there. That's what I'm thinking about for outside decorating. But um, I am going to, I think that's all the points I wanted to cover for today. I'll see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog. If you guys did enjoy today's, make sure you guys give it a big old thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love if you'd subscribe. And I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow. So bye guys.